Hi guys, it's uh, October here. I thought um, I would start this video which is basically about um, sacred um, circles, you know, sort of pros and cons and um, if it's something that you resonated um, towards, resonating towards or whether um, you're unsure or whether it's something that doesn't resonate with you so much for whatever those personal reasons are. So I thought I would share um, by starting the video with this. Um, in my other video you will have seen this um, circular dish which I use predominantly for uh, solar or lunar workings. Particularly um, certain um, moon phases and cycles on things I'm doing within them. This bowl in itself, this bowl in itself, I use quite a lot for different things. Now, it looks to me very um, both solar and lunar in its spherical shape. So that also draws me into sometimes how it can be kind of incorporated like um, a form of a circle. To me it's like a circle within a circle within a circle because we have the circle on the outside and then we have the kind of rim of the inside and then the inside so it's like a triple circle. So um, sometimes if I'm doing workings I will put whatever it is I'm doing within this because it's kind of like its own circle. So you don't have to actually cast a circle in the regular sense of the word. Um, I think that um, this type of use um, can be more um, useful for people like myself and um, for people of you, people who know, people, sorry try that again, for those of you who know more about um, my family background which is my son has autism um, he can shoot into a room at the blinking of an eye with needing something, come darting into the room like mum, 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 you know, type of thing. And um, normally I wouldn't even attempt a ritual or anything like that if he was within the home, if he was up or anything like that. But on the odd occasion I have tried it, it doesn't work because um, he comes heading into the room and to, right up to where you are at. Now obviously that's not very good if you've cast a circle and you're in the middle of something. Um, although you can make doorways to leave your circle, um, it's not really suitable for me because when my son comes down and he needs something, I have to react immediately to what's going on with him. I don't have time to think about it or uh, deal with other things. So I feel in this instance um, this type of thing usually works better for me. So there is pros and cons. The pros are, yes, sacred circle is always going to be beneficial if um, you want to go down that route. There's not many cons against casting a circle, but um, sometimes casting a circle just isn't suitable for particular home environments such as it's very hard for me to get um, the time and know that I'm not going to be interrupted and that my son's not going to come here and down the stairs right in the middle of something. Whereas if the energies are contained within this particular dish here, as in whatever it is you're doing, even if my son was to come in and need something right in the middle of it, I can leave this and it's safe and it's not going to be disturbed and um, my son coming in is not going to interfere with what's going on. Um, obviously depending on what I'm doing I prefer to be here but sometimes if I need to nip off, um, if I've done the main body of what I'm doing I can nip off and then come back. It's not ideal but it is better and easier for me to do that than it is if I have cast a full circle within the room and my son comes down in the middle of what I'm doing and needs something. So it's really an individual thing for me. It's what works for me and what works for my family. So basically do whatever works for you. 
if you're able to cast circles whenever you feel you need to or whenever you feel uh, that it would be beneficial to you to do so then obviously brilliant but um, if you're not keep certain things like this in mind because it could be helpful if you have a dependent in the house a young child in the house or um, somebody within the home that um, makes casting a full circle within the whole room or your sacred space or whatever more difficult to do so I thought I would share this as a little pros and cons and predominantly just and maybe another way is probably the best way of um, describing it as a way of using sacred space in a different format so I hope that that was a little bit helpful.